How are you being pulled? Thank you. I wanted to ask you about um, some of the things the president said last week. Um, last week? Or, yes. Uh, okay. Obviously, 13 U.S. service members died at Abbey yeah. Gate during the Afghanistan withdrawal. And then this year, three U.S. service members died in a drone attack in Jordan. And yet the president said, quote, he's the only president this century, this decade, that doesn't have any troops dying anywhere in the world like he did, end quote. I get having a bad night, but how could the president get that so wrong? So I appreciate the question. I really do. And I was asked about this, I believe, in the gaggle on Friday, I believe. Um, and I said this, and I'll just reiterate this uh, now, and again, I appreciate the opportunity. Look, the president cares deeply about our service members. He does. Uh, and their families, their immense sacrifices that they've made uh, to take on the pr and and, uh, and he takes on his responsibility as a commander in chief, and that is something that certainly he will continue to do. I mentioned uh, moments ago that tomorrow on July 4th, he's going to have active military members here and their families uh, to thank them personally. And obviously, they make their families make sacrifices as well. And as you know, he attended the dignified transfer of the 13, as you just mentioned, brave service members who lost their lives in Afghanistan on August 26 uh, in 2021, and as well as the three who lost their lives in Jordan earlier this year. I was there uh, uh, with the president. And you can see how much it, it how important he he understood it was for him to be there for that moment, to be there for the families. Uh, and so uh, just want to want to be really clear about that because he has so much gratitude. And we know that as a country, we can never repay them uh, for their courage. Uh, but to your question, um, the president was making a comparison between how many service members have died under his leadership versus in previous years. Uh, that's what the comparison that he was uh, making, and he is doing, uh, doing. He was doing that because he cares so deeply, cares so deeply about them and their families, and wants to keep troops safe.